temperature. Winter cold. We always get people asking that. Well, people asking that. Well, you know, it, it was it cold enough to kill the beetles? No. What you need are days, several days, consistently never above minus 35. <laughs> never. Yeah, yeah, you know. And we're not counting wind chill here, people. We need, well, two days. We, we need, what they have found is we need a, probably a minimum of 48 solid hours of never getting above 35. Once it gets to minus about, 30. minus 35, yes. Once it gets to about from December through February, March. I mean, and is that impossible? No, it's probably not impossible here. It's a pretty darn depressing thought. Even, uh, you know, even if you don't like uh, bugs, that's probably a pretty, uh, those would be depressing days if that really happened. Um, the one place, if you look at the graph here, you, that we can get some effect from cold temperatures are in the fall, like this time of year, and it still has to get... Minus 15. It still has to get well colder than normal, but not to the uh, real extreme cold levels. Or again, in the spring, you know, in, in April and, and early May, because, at, you know, at this time, like this time of year, the small beetles, the larvae, have hatched out and have started feeding under the bark of the tree. And so they're active and everything else. And if we get a real cold snap now, and again, much colder than normal, they'll be uh, affected and it'll kill most of them. And again, in the same thing in the spring when, when they start feeding again and are active. Once we get into the dead of winter, they basically, the beetles under the bark, and they have been here far longer than we have. They're far better adapted to the Black Hills than, than, uh, as far as surviving than we are. When we get into the middle of winter, they basically take all the water out of their body and uh, replace it with a form of glycol, basically a form of antifreeze. I mean, that's why it has to get to those just brutally cold temperatures when we get there to kill them. 